Good morning. Good morning. On our way to the doctor's again. Again. Yeah, this is going to be an ongoing thing for a month or two. But we haven't uh, haven't really been doing too much video wise. Um, Ain't nothing going on. Yeah, not really a whole lot going on. Uh, I am taping, you know, repairs and upgrades and stuff as I can. Um, You've been putting up reviews on your other channel. Yeah, I put up a product review on my other channel. Uh, I'll try and link it. Not sure if I can link it someplace. Who knows where? Maybe right in the middle? Maybe? Who knows? Anyway, I'll try and link that. Uh, it's an old channel I had like five years ago. And I did some reviews. And, uh, you know, real life happened. So I just never did anything with it. And, uh, you know, I pretty much sucked anyway. Oh, you did not. <laughs> But, People are um, watching it. But it's starting to get a whole lot of views. And uh, it's got like 50,000 views, but f over five years, it's not really a whole lot. Anyway, so I'll try and link that. If not, it'll be down in the description for sure. But So we're going to the doctor. Uh, and then uh, see what they got to say. Probably back to the hospital. And then... Uh, we got some dentist appointments coming up. And, uh, and somebody needs to have his blood pressure checked again. And, uh, yeah, my blood pressure's been a little high. Um, welcome to the RV life. A little stressful. But, welcome uh, to 50. How about that? Welcome, yeah, welcome to being 50. Yeah. That's stressful, too. Yeah. So, but we're going to be late if I don't start driving. And uh, I'm in my buddy's pickup truck. So, uh, I don't have like a camera mount and I'm not gonna be recording a whole lot of stuff, but we just wanted to do a morning video and, um, maybe we can get some, <clears throat> some shots of some other stuff later. Yeah, right. small update. Goodbye. Okay, bye. Morning, everyone. Got a little job today. I'm gonna go help some friends, a diesel repair specialist. Uh, she called me help them out a little bit they, they've been my mechanic for seven plus years uh, when I drove a truck and I owned it so I had them as my mechanic and uh, now that I'm kind of not driving anymore she uh, uses me to do stuff around there a little day labor type stuff you know today I'm gonna drive a forklift so we'll see what that entails but uh, anyway I don't have a mount kind of holding it and driving which is taboo so I'll get back with you all right bye hey guys so that's what I've been doing today moving a bunch of stuff from all around here driving the high low big puppy gonna move these engines over and put them in a storage area swept all this parking lot up cut some grass just had lunch, getting ready to figure out what else she wants me to do. But just let you know what's going on. That's my job for today. So should be pretty cool. Alright, bye. Long day, put in nine hours. Got a lot of work done. Drove about, I don't know, three, three and a half hours. Got all the stuff done that she wanted me to do. She did ask me to come back tomorrow, so make a little bit more money. That'd be alright with me. So anyway, that's it for today. Y'all have a good night. street sweeper for a test drive and having an extra steering wheel over there doing the same thing I'm doing is kind of weird but look at all these damn switches and stuff 
thing's crazy. Anyway, been a busy one today. Uh, put a glow plug module on a GMC van. Yeah, it was a diesel, obviously. What else I do? Test drove F550. Test drove uh, this street sweeper. Put an alternator on an excursion. Might put back brakes on the same excursion, not sure. But anyway, before I get caught driving around, put my phone up. <laughs> I should probably go ahead and let y'all go, but I'll holler at you. Okay, bye. Time to go for a ride to my mom's. Got my bike all set up, and uh, I'll take you with me. All right, bye. So yeah, haven't done anything in a couple days. Been kind of busy. Today I'm building raised plant stands, planters basically. That's the start of one. And they're gonna go over here. And yesterday I ran that brickwork. They're gonna fill that in with some gravel. And I'm gonna move that rock over here. And uh, that's what I've been doing. Working on stuff when I can, cleaning up, helping out, whatever I do. Uh, still at Diesel Repair Specialist, doing what I can. But that's it. I just wanted to show you what's going on. Uh, let's see if I can't show you the finished product. All right, bye. So that's the finished product, raised planter. All right, bye. Good morning, everyone. You're not gonna say hello. Hello. <laughs> uh, doctor's appointment Friday. Today is Wednesday. I uh, I hurt my back pretty bad on uh, Friday, and uh, I worked anyway Monday and Tuesday. I shouldn't have. Um, Yesterday building the plant stands, uh, moving the lumber, I hurt it even more. So uh, I'm not getting around so good right now. So uh, I'm not working. Uh, the good folks at Diesel Repair Specialists um, have known me for years, so they understand. And it's not a big deal. I'll go back Monday and. Uh, finish what I started and do whatever else comes up but for now I need to take some time off and let my back heal up it's an ongoing problem happens all the time um, you haven't been able to hear too much from Laura because uh, well she's been home and I take the phone with me to work so he's trapped me here so she's bored and has no idea how to use her tablet to make a video <laughs> I'm not using that tablet which is five years old to make a video. Okay. I'm doing it. I can use 
that other phone over there if I wish to. That was a cheap shot. Yeah, I thank you. you. I had to. Yeah, well, fuck you. But uh, yeah, I just wanted <laughs> to give you guys an update. Uh, you know, we're we're doing doing what we do, trying to make it through these doctor's appointments and stuff. And uh, what what is it you're having? MRI. No. Ear, EKG. No, no, no. <laughs> One no. of the initials. I'm just going uh, to the gynecologist. <laughs> oh, yeah, okay. And then they'll make a decision on what to do. I have fibroids. It's not detrimental. Not going to die. But they need to come out. So that's what the appointment's about. And it'll be interesting because if they do do surgery... I'm going to be in a camper. So that's going to be different. For all you people out there that are wondering how you manage surgery in a camper. We're going to find out. So upcoming videos um, are probably going to be a lot of this and a lot of what you just saw. Uh, you know, bits and pieces of when I'm at work, and um, uh, Laura can maybe record a little bit because she's been like making the sweater, which is nice. Yeah, I'm almost done. Not quite yet. It's getting there. <clears throat> and uh, you know, I'm editing when I can. But uh, not really a whole lot of footage, just uh, just kind of recording little tidbits that I think are cool. You know, the street sweeper was definitely cool. I should have recorded the uh, transit bus, which is the biggest thing I think I've ever driven. That thing's got to be 90 feet long. and You should have. You sit literally about 8 foot in front of the front tire, so it's so weird to drive it. Well, that was pretty cool, too. Fire truck. You get a fire truck, you can drive the fire truck. Yeah, one of my bucket list things is I want to drive a fire truck and I want to run the sirens while I'm driving it. So, if you ever get a fire truck in with a uh, electrical problem, they actually told me that uh, that they get to do that. They have to clear it with the city and all that, and they get to do it, run it with the sirens and blow the lights and all that good stuff. And uh, <laughs> I'm top, I'm top of the list for when one comes in and needs to be test driven. I get to do it if I'm there. So. Fire marshal Bill. That's pretty cool. Um, <laughs> uh, I did somewhere in a video, uh, I said that I would link below, uh, diesel repair specialist if you're ever in the Detroit area. Um, it's about 15 minutes from downtown Detroit in Dearborn Heights. And, uh, I will link what I can to them. Uh, they had two RVs, big class A's in there. Um, they worked on Dottie. While I, while I was there, they've. They've done, uh, they won't really, I don't think they'll do the engine work on Dottie because it's gas. But they did do uh, my air shocks and pinion seal and stuff. So, yeah. you know, we might be able to give them a call and see what's going on. Um, I, for obvious reasons, won't put their phone number down. But uh, I'll give you links to whatever I can give you as far as that they go. If you ever need them, there they are. Um... Now what's going on? Playing a waiting game. That's about it. If I get back, gets to feeling a little better. I'm going to fix a couple things around here, and I'll probably record that. But uh, as it stands right now, I can hardly get out of my seat. So Still waiting on the dentist. I'm going to have to yeah. call him. Going to have to call the dentist. Probably Monday. See what's going on with that. Yep. yep. But that's it. Uh, taking our medicines and... Anyway, yeah, the last visit to the doctor, which we didn't really put anything. I just said that we were going to the doctor, and then we never recorded coming out. Um, <laughs> I wasn't feeling. I wasn't feeling well. I ended up having a pretty bad sinus infection. My whole left side of my sinuses was full of blood, and uh, so I got a couple shots in the ass, which I've never heard of a shot in the ass for a decongestant, but that's what he said. And antibiotics. I'm still taking antibiotics, and my blood pressure is high, like I said. So I'm taking blood pressure medication because I'm old. And You're 50. Woohoo! You know, See what you get to look forward to when you hit 50. Yeah. Pills. So. And you're supposed to be taking D2. 
vitamin D too. Yes, and apparently my vitamin D is quite low, so I'm supposed to take that too, which I haven't made it to get yet. But, yeah. uh, you know, the whole financial situation, I'm barely making enough to pay the bills, and that's okay with me, but you know, we need to step it up, and if I keep hurting myself, that's not going to happen, so. So you got to spread that out a little bit better. So donate below. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Buy me a beer. <laughs> That'd be all right. That's a relaxing. That's a relaxing <clears throat> drink right there. Actually, I read somebody who did that for a donate button. He put buy me a beer. Are you kidding me? Right? No. Okay. It actually worked. And I seen one the other day that said tip jar, which was kind of crafty. Yes. Yeah. No. Oh. Hmm. Pity Sam. Pity Sam. <laughs> um, AdSense. Um, no, we're not making anything on this. I'm making about three cents a month, which Ooh. is who booming. Um, you know, it helps if you comment, like. Yeah. Um, you know. Doesn't that up your score? Let if the you ads comment? run. Yeah, I'll, I don't know if everybody knows this or not. It's pretty common knowledge for people, but you, uh, every time you like a video or comment on it, it ups my ranking so that my, my videos get shown more on the little troll bar on the side. Like us. So, thumbs comment up. Comment below. Thumbs up are important. Comments are good. I try to answer every one. Um, I'm not quite so timely when I'm at work. But uh, I will try within a day to get, get them answered. Um, obviously to a point to where, you know, there's so many that I can't. But I'll do what I can. That'll be way off, isn't it? I can answer the whole two or three comments that I do get. So I think we're good. <laughs> and uh, what, what, like five people watch it. So if you can share it, that'd be pretty awesome too. That helps out a great deal. I think sharing boosts it too, yeah. doesn't it? Yeah. yeah. So... Okay, I think that's it. I don't have much else to say. What do you got? No. Nothing? Not really. Nothing. Oh, I had an epiphany, and I think what I'm going to do on my WordPress is I'm going to make another page, and I'm going to write about our past and what we've done, um, our crazy trips and things that we've randomly done um, in the past to get us to this point like packing up and moving to Florida and that took one month packing up and moving up to Michigan and these decisions that we make are random and quick we don't sit around and him haw about it because then you scare yourself out of it but I thought about... Or you just don't have time. Uh, you know, you get stuck doing something else. So, um, yeah, I thought I'd start from the beginning on um, Rochelle. I think that's when we sold the, double, the, the single wide in Bonaire, Georgia we lived there a very long time, raised kids there. And uh, I think I'll start with Rochelle, how we got there. Okay. So well, there you go, there'll be some, some good reading on the blog, hopefully real soon. Um, she's been updating anyways, and she stays pretty active on Facebook, because I just don't have time. Um, well, I try to, I don't do it Between work and fixing Dottie and editing videos that I do take, um, I'm pretty well took up for time. Um, you're not now because you're healing. Yeah, for the next few days I'm kind of sitting around on my bum. So we'll see how that goes. Now for real I'm done. So okay. you guys have a wonderful day and we will see you on the next one. Take care. Bye. Bye.